Hi, my name is Jay. I'm a drug addict and an alcoholic, and I'm also an alumni of the Betty Ford Center Residential Day Treatment Program. As an addict, I really reached uh, my true bottom when uh, I was, had been to treatment and relapsed and was using and just my life was falling apart. I couldn't uh, keep my job. I was totally out of money. I isolated from my family and all my friends. And I was really at the point of uh, thinking about committing suicide, but luckily I knew that help was available if I asked for it, and that's what uh, brought me back. The biggest impact of treatment for me was being isolated away from the ability to use and drink. It was important for me to kind of be removed from the environment on a semi-permanent basis. So that was the starting point to kind of clearing out my head and detoxing. Then uh, what really had the most impact on me was the fact that the staff and everyone I was in contact was with truly cared about me and the people I was in treatment with. Uh, their main concern and what I felt was that they only wanted me to be healthy and to be sober. Uh, and then the other thing was the authenticity of the relationships that I made with people that I was in treatment with. Uh, addicts and alcoholics can relate to each other on a level that no one else can, I don't, I don't believe. It's that bond of common suffering that really um, allows us to relate on a, a deeper, more authentic level than the average person can. And many people who have never been through what we've been through have no comprehension of what it's like and they simply don't understand it. If someone is considering or trying to decide for themselves whether they have an addiction or, or a problem, uh, what I would say is that you have to look at yourself and determine is the substance that you're considering uh, changing your life or controlling your life and taking you to places that you don't want to be. The other thing that I've heard a lot and I find to be true is that people that aren't addicts or alcoholics don't ever wonder whether they are. It's only the people that actually are that wonder. I used drugs and alcohol my entire life and I really could have no concept of life without, the, without substances. And five years later, uh, my life has changed immensely and it's absolutely wonderful and enjoyable without drugs and alcohol. Yet, even the day I came to treatment, I had no real concept or idea of that that was possible for me.